Long Worth, photographer extraordinaire, and Chris Barron, filmmaker extraordinaire as well. I love these guys. I've collaborated with them on a few projects already. And um, yeah, these guys are close to my heart. I love these boys. Hey, how you doing? Take a seat, my friend. Yeah, I will, man. Come join you guys. Snuggle up. Snuggle, snuggle. Uh, by the way, wicked t shirt, Baron. Thanks, dude. Love it, mate. <laughs> it's funny because it's true. It is, it is. <laughs> so, here I am with Pete Longworth, and um, we've known each other for a fair few years now, haven't we, buddy? We have, actually, mate. Yeah. It's. Well, we Eight first years met. Now? Yeah. We first met, I was, I was playing um, this cool little venue called Bar Broadway, and um, Pete was. Attending the bars there, weren't you? Yes. And I was yes. playing guitar and stuff like that. I used like, to sneak out in my lunch breaks <laughs> and take photos of all the bands that would play there, and that was how I got my start <laughs> many years ago. <laughs> so, and so um, we've been kind of um, always in each other's pockets and doing fun since, little yeah, projects. It's been a fun yeah. little journey. So, <laughs> really lucky. So um, I believe for. Um, it so happens to be Hyde Park's 200th anniversary this year. Yep. And I believe you've done an amazing body of work called Life on Top of Hyde yeah. Park. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, do you want to tell us a bit about that whole project, Pete? Um, so this is a, a body of work that sort of celebrates um, Hyde Park in Sydney. And it's a uh, it's quite a beautiful little park. And my brief was to... Uh, provide a bit of a romantic interpretation of what living somewhere near this park would be all about and so I spent uh, two months pretty much living and breathing every corner of Hyde Park and um, my, my trusty yeah. assistant here. <laughs> And the, oh, the dog, you were so lucky to, to actually stay in this place called oh, The Residence. Yes, yes. And that was amazing. Um, I, had a very, yeah. I had a very lucky gig where the, um, the property development that commissioned this body of work had a, uh, an empty building right on Hyde Park. So for about six months in total, I lived on the 19th floor of the uh, empty apartment block and I uh, looked straight down over Hyde Park. I mean, it was empty. I had nothing but a, a mattress on the floor <laughs> and, a, and a couch about three minutes worth of hot water. But uh, for six months, I had one of the best uh, addresses in yeah, Sydney, in so, Sydney. which was pretty plush. And then we put it all together and built this um, coffee table book. It blew out into an exhibition, which was um, quite a little amazing thing that kicked off. Mm. And then um, from that... Yeah, from that... We um, worked together on, on this project called Life Top of High Park, and it's a nice little kind of CD, DVD um, booklet, so very nice. So it's basically got my favourite 30 images um, put together in a little booklet, and uh, Mike did all the music for the opening of my exhibition. <laughs> he wrote all the music and... Uh, had we performed had it live, which yeah. was quite amazing. Had a little, little with Phil Sander on Steinway piano, and also Yama Sasha on tabla. Yeah, we had Junpei Hashimoto from the Tokyo Wind Orchestra join us as well. But also an integral part of this, da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. we had Chris Barron um, work with on the Final Cut Pro. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, <on the> Final <laughs> Cut Pro <laughs> on the After Effects. That's it. Um, tie it all in with. Um, Pete Longworth's images and put it together. Your music. Yeah, oh, yes, yes, absolutely. And um, you, you did um, recently. Um, you did another time, another pace. Yeah. And um, yeah, tell us a bit about what happened with that. Yeah. So um, we uh, you got screened on Rage as a video clip, and we kind of uh, reinvented it a bit and turned it into something of an experimental. Uh, short film and uh, that got to screen overseas and went to the UK to end of the peer film festival there and also in July it's going to New York Independent Film Festival we wow. screened there Woo! last week of July <laughs> yeah. so that's it's basically a convergence of the music of the images and Chris has brought the video and the, and the multimedia into it so it's kind of a, a sexed up slideshow slash movie slash yeah. film we even movie. incorporated some contemporary dances uh, yeah, in when it, it as well when we did the performance piece we had a so, um, thanks Chantel <laughs> yes indeed that was amazing yeah um, yeah so wow and so what about what's the next step what's on the horizon guys 
Mumbai. 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 Cool. So, yeah. Well, thanks, guys. We'll for Yeah, we'll keep now. you posted on all of that. But we do have a couple of performances coming up soon. Pete's got a gallery exhibition happening on May 20th. May 20th at Opens. Yeah. And you can find... Can I do yeah. the, the plug? Yeah, we'll have you, the details scroll along the bottom right there. If you go to <laughs> PeteLongworth.com, you'll find all the information. So it's PeteLongworth.com. You'll find that. And, of course, the basement. Yes, the basement. So we've got a performance coming up at the basement too. So come along and see that on May 15th at the basement. Cool. See you guys. See you guys.